Welcome to Math Challenge Problem. Today, let us have algebra and let us do factoring using a splitting method and adding and subtracting suitable terms. Let us have this expression x cubed minus 3x squared plus 4. From the methods of factoring polynomials that we uh, have known so far, x cubed minus 3x squared plus 4 seem to be not factorable. We had common monomial factor, the difference of two squares, a perfect square trinomial, and other special products formula. Also, factoring a quadratic trinomial. We also had factor by grouping and adding and subtracting suitable terms. X cubed minus 3x squared plus 4 can be factored if we do first the splitting method with negative 3x squared. So if we rewrite negative 3x squared as x squared minus 4x squared plus 4, then we now have a common monomial factor in x cubed and x squared. Also a common monomial factor in negative 4x squared plus 4. However, when we factor x squared in the first group, what remains is x plus 1. And in the second group, if we factor negative 4, what remains is x squared minus 1. So we do not have a common binomial factor. Notice that we have x squared and positive 4, which can be made a perfect square trinomial when we add negative 4x or 4x to the expression. Hence, we will do as the next method, adding and subtracting suitable terms, and that is 4x. So we have x cubed plus x squared minus 4x squared. Now we have minus 4x plus 4x and then plus 4. Notice that after the manipulations that we've had in this algebraic expression, the resulting expression is still equal to the original expression. Now we can group the terms in the resulting expression as x cubed plus x squared minus 4x squared plus 4x plus 4x plus 4. And then we can Factor each group using common monomial factor. In the first group, we have x squared times x plus 1. In the second group, we have 4x, so that's minus 4x times the quantity x plus 1. In the last group, we have 4, so we have 4 times x plus 1. Notice that the binomial x plus 1 is common to the three resulting groups in our expression. Then, x plus 1 is a common binomial factor, so we have x plus 1 times the quantity x squared minus 4x plus 4. Notice that the second factor resulted into a perfect squared trinomial. Hence, the complete factor of x cubed minus 3x squared plus 4 is x plus 1 times x minus 2 squared. That will be all. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for more math challenge problems.